It's very simple to watch the Living Faith Network online. Visit watch.ulfn.org. On the page, click on the register option and fill out the on-screen form. You will also be required to confirm your account by email. Next, return to the watch.ulfn.org page. Once you are there, click on the option 24 hour stream. And there you go. Invest in your faith daily with live programs and testimonies that will prove to you that faith in action brings real results. Register today for free. So friends, it's now 9.04 and it's about the time for us to begin the prayer on your behalf. Pastor Junior, we are going to pray for those that they have been calling us throughout the days. Those that have been sending us their pictures as well. And also, we have a special prayer on behalf of the nation of Trinidad and Tobago. Because we understand, Pastor Philip, that only God has power to change this nation and make this nation to improve and also to bless those who send their names to be placed inside of the holy oil and uh, tonight we are going all the way to tobago because pastor Márcio is going to be making this special prayer on your behalf pastor Márcio is with you hello pastor philip good night everyone as you can see here i am before the altar in tobago my dear, now we're going to make our prayer. Believe God, He will answer us. My dear, God, He will bless Tobago, our country, Trinidad and Tobago. So where you are, close your eyes. My Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus, you know our situation. So we ask you, show your power, my God. Let impossible to become possible. Father, send your strong angel in the four corners of this country to destroy coronavirus. My God, those who was affected, my God, those who are sick, deliver, set them free, free and deep. So restore, my God, their health. In the name of the Lord Jesus, I pray for those who lost a family member to coronavirus. My God, comfort them. In the name of the Lord Jesus, show your power. Bless my God or a prime minister. Give instruction how we're going to overcome, my God, this situation. How no one will be affected anymore. We need, my God, you. We need your help. We need protection. Protect, my God, this country. Protect this nation. My God, those who believe in you, honor them, bless them. I know, my God, because of this situation, many people, they lost their job. They cannot work. They cannot open their business door so my God provide everything to them bring prosperity my God your people they cannot beg for bread in the name of the Lord Jesus my God I surrender Trinidad and Tobago and to your whole and might hands we do believe after this storm your people they will share great my God this demand in the name of the Father Son and the Holy spirit i ask you, my god to consecrate this glass of water your people they will drink this powerful element will be a point of contact between you and those who believe in your word and your promise they will receive healing they will receive a miracle my father so honor honor then in the name of the lord jesus christ and those who agree say amen amen praise god so friends do not forget that tomorrow nine o'clock p.m we are going to be back with another prayer but also tomorrow tuesday we are going to have three services 8 30 in the morning 1 p.m 
and also 5 p.m. For those three services, you can invite your family members, your friends. You can be in your house. They can be in their house. Or if they live with you, invite them. Tell them to prepare a glass of water because three times for the day tomorrow, we are going to be blessing it. Tomorrow, 8.30 in the morning, uh, 1 o'clock and also 5 o'clock. Correct? Yes. 8.30 in the morning. I'll be, I'll be with you and also at 5 p.m. So friends, have yourself a very blessed night. See you. Unisocial Trinidad and Tobago. Continuing with this tremendous effort, partnering with the Member of Parliament, the Honorable Mrs. Glenda Jennings Smith, we have taken the initiative of preparing, providing, and distributing 150 boxes of lunch for the children whose mothers and my extension parents became unemployed due to the COVID crisis. Hello friends of our program Beyond Limit. And we are doing, Laura, this very special work in a partnership with the Unisocial of the Universal Church and also uh, the government of Trinidad and Tobago, also with the Minister of Parliament, Mrs. Glenda Jenny Smith, and we are helping the community today in Sandy Grande. Throughout the years, the Universal Church have been working in various communities to help those who are not able to help themselves. Pray and we ask the Lord for you to bless this food, bless those that have prepared, those that have helped, donated. And in the name of Jesus, we determine and we declare, Father, 
that as we are helping the people in the community of Sandy Grande, my God, let this food be like medication, strength to all of them that receive it. In Jesus' name, amen. Reaching out to the community of Kukurit, distributing hampers. We are here in the community of Kukurit, Trinidad and Tobago, alongside with the Unisocial and also with the Caleb Group. We have come here today for a very special day, a Unisocial day, and we are distributing here today hampers. Thank you very much for those of you who are supporters of this ministry, supporters of this program, because your seed, the seed that you have been sowing there, has helped a lot of people here in Trinidad and Tobago as well. And we have here Miss Miss Tara Papan, and we are going to give to her this hamper with the help of those of you who are uh, uh, our supporters of this ministry of this program. And alongside here with the Caleb Group and the Unisocial, we are making one more family, one more, one more person here blessed and happy. Thank you so much for your support. Another great effort meeting those in need with the distribution of over 2,500 hampers. Well, the People's National Movement, along with the Universal Church, under our goodly pastor here, decided that it's time for us to come out and touch the people. It's our initiative, it's our food drive, and we're trying to touch as much homes. I think, from what I understand, the Universal Church is going to give out 2,500. You see? I must say God bless you all and you know I look forward to many more um, interventions like these because you know Toko Sandy Grande is one of the poorest community, one of the poorest constituency in Trinidad and Tobago and any kind of venture like this and even at the end when we gave out just the baggage you know everything it was really well organized and I must thank pastor, all the pastors involved from your church and as well as you all who came on board and offered your services. I mean, today was an was a indoor service facility today where we had services of every kind to make people feel comforted and pampered. So I am very, very impressed and I'm happy and thrilled you know, in working with you all in the future and you know, looking at issues such as this and bringing these kind of services to people who cannot get it ordinarily. So certainly we, it was a really good occasion today.